Good morning, good morning. Welcome to CCTV. Hey guys, I am recruiting researchers. You've got no pay. It's a labor of love. It's tiring. You get up early, you go to bed late, which a lot of you do anyways. So I'm going to show you on FAA cams real quick before I do a filtering show of this. Um, how I do the FAA cams so quick, okay? Probably you could do... Uh, the best time to look at FAA cams if you're on the west coast is about 6 in the morning. If you're on the east coast, uh, probably like real time, 6, 7 in the morning. There, okay? And I'll show you how I do it. So let's do it. Is everybody doing great? I hope. I hope you hear my voice. So I'll start right here. You know, you do a research on FAA aviation weather cameras. I just go FAA cams. Click the button, boom, okay, this is a, a site map for per area. This is fast, but I get a better control on it if I go to the maps up here. Okay. Let me go to maps. I go to maps, and you get more real-time view, right? So there's my address, if you, you know, Copy TV gmail.com, popitv18 at gmail.com. Um, they blocked a lot of emails from probably the last three months, and I've been telling people I think they're blocking me. I think they did. Uh, like five guys only can get through out of like 80. So that's why I'm kind of recruiting again. Um, I do show the pictures. I still have a lot of subscriber pictures, and I have a lot of my pictures, but you know, I want to try to get those shots nobody's catching because there's a lot of cameras. As you can see here, this is Canada in the blue, Nova Scotia, Newfoundland, um, Winnipeg, Canada. So you're actually researching this whole continent. Now, if you look here, Alaska is dark right now, right? So I don't, I don't bother, even though it's dark. You know, the sun sets in the west, right? Last night. And sometimes in the morning, the sun comes up or sits in the west. So don't skip the west. Always look to the west and the north because there's stuff happening. So I start down here by Detroit. And I want to see if it's sunny out. It is. So I'm looking for, like this, I'm looking for certain things. Just a quick lesson. I look at them. I just go to where the light is. I go to where the color is. And I want to see what's happening. You can see R2 coming down right there. So I just take a picture. Save image. Right? And I have a little thing called Mapple, which is where I'm going to do some filtering. I'd add it to now, which means it's not filtered. I just caught it, and I just check it by date. So that's, you know, there's another. I don't want to throw none of these away, even though I'm saving them in the, the video. And I just pop these off. Clearly, R2 coming in this morning. So now I'm looking east, R2, let's look south, just to see if anything else is happening. South, you can still see the, the sun rising in the east. That don't make sense, right? So you go back to east, and you go, okay, sun's rising in the east. Same time, let's go back to south, right there, same time. Sun's rising in the south. Wait a minute. Okay, so that's how you find pictures. If you want to put the story together and use Bandicam, Bandicam's free, the version I'm using. Um, it's cheap enough to buy, but, I, you know, I, I started out with it, I always kept it, and now it's good for short videos. And I think I will purchase uh, the Bandicam and the Bandicam Cut. So this is kind of like an instructional video. Um, so just a little bit more. So what I do, once I find something, I check all the cameras because, you know, you never know. Um, north. I'll check it, see what's going on. A lot of times you're seeing planets, UFOs, stuff like that you can't explain. Okay, so if you go that route, you could just go down this, this, you know, you don't want Alaska right now, you want British Columbia. So you just keep on going. Now that one I normally will look at, because it's round and it's black. What is it? And so I like that. So sometimes I'll take and make a side note with an actual pen or a little notebook pad. Now, don't believe these cameras are turned off because you see the, the blockade there. You see how they, you see how they blocked it? 
Well, it's not blocked, right? A lot of them are like that. They do that until they can get back and, and take the planet out. Or the star. See how they take pictures out? And the rest of the day. So that tells me in the southwest something's going on, right? Well, we know the east is acting weird. Okay, so I'm going to go back to the map view. And just show you for a second. It's about five minutes I'm showing you this for. I don't want to make it too long, but this is what I do. I just, I go blazing fast. And if it doesn't have something I like, or I think will be there, I don't look at it. I don't waste the time. But I am looking for the south and the east. Here's the south of Serena. I think we looked at this. It's totally coming up, the sun, in the south. Look at that. So you, you say, okay, that's pretty cool looking. I want to save that one in my now folder. Maybe create yourself a now folder. Now there's a couple ways that you could send stuff to me by email. You could also put it in your file view. Look at this, guys, how the sky looks. I'm saving it, right? But look right here, how there's one missing and there. These shots, if you filter them, a lot of times you'll get the asteroids, the rocks, side planets little red planets i don't know you get all kinds of stuff so i'm kind of addicted to hunting more than i am showing you video look at that up to right there so i put them in my now folder you know and you guys can easily start a channel i'll help you get uh traffic i know how to do traffic at least a little traffic there's a double sun so i save those and do a filtering video out of it like I'm going to show you right now. Okay, so I'm going to go to my filter. And I'm going to refresh all the stuff I just put in my now folder. I'm just going to refresh that. Oh. Locked up. Locks up because I need more RAM. Okay, so I'm going to go to my my now folder someday when I get there I'm in the wrong place now folder on my desktop see I got so a lot of sub stuff I haven't showed yet but I will it takes time you guys send good stuff you know I'm gonna cheat anybody Douglas you know he's got about six videos from me uh, Roger Paul's got about four videos from me a lot of you guys on shout outs got none you know shout out whole list playlist of shout out videos so and so I'm hanging up here don't know why resources uh, something's colliding something's hanging me up there you go so my now folder is pretty interesting because Sometimes I'll get hunting and I'll find something like this. This was last night, I could tell. Yeah, 1222. You know, you look at that and you go, oh, that just looks like nice clouds. Okay. There's a couple ways we could do this with a filter. We could just do an automatic dehaze and go darker with it. Add the ag, ag collection. So, and I take them in, you know, and I play with them until I get, I want to see what I saw. Get rid of that. So, I'm always curious to get the best shot. Um, I want to look through the clouds, so I try different colors. You can see that right there. See that? Those are possibly asteroids flying through. Okay, guys, so this is a quick how to. I'm recruiting video. Um, and I'll put that one up real quick, and then I'll come back to this folder. We'll start right here where I left off. And, uh,. Let's do some filtering. Let's see if I can end it with this thing. How about red? I don't like it. That's the original. See, see, I see that clearly. Something going on. Anyways, I'll be back. It's about over. Um, you can't go in the skies without seeing Samuel Hoffman's uh, model, folks. You know. I mean, I don't get nothing for shouting out Sam Hoffman. He actually, I don't think he wants me to do it, but, you know, he's the one that taught me this.